All right, breaking news out of the NFL. Las Vegas Raiders are hiring Patriots offensive coordinator Josh McDaniels as their next head coach. Our Jonathan Jones has confirmed. McDaniels' previous head coaching experience came with the Broncos. He was in charge 09 to 2010. Then it looked like he was going to the Colts, but didn't. Essentially went back to the Patriots, where he's been their OC since 2012. So, he is the new man in Vegas, replacing Rich Bisaccia, who took over as interim coach during week six after John Gruden resigned, took Vegas to the playoffs, but that regime got cleaned out. It'll be a new group of folks. The GM has come over from New England, and he brings with him Josh McDaniels. All right, more on this. Brian McFadden, two-time Super Bowl champion. Jonathan Jones, CBS Sports Senior NFL writer. JJ, I'll start with you. What do we know about the idea of Josh McDaniels going to Vegas? Seems like it's now Vegas' New England Southwest, I guess. <laughs> That's right. It's, it's uh, New England in the desert. Um, this has been really in the works for more than a week, and we uh, told you about this dating back, I think, last Friday. So Dave Ziegler, the new general manager, he was there uh, helping – uh, Bill Belichick run the draft, run, and, and really sort of influenced him uh, when the Patriots made those big splashes in free agency, very unpatriots-like, right? And so he and Josh McDaniels obviously having worked together for some time now. Uh, Josh McDaniels here, he knows what happened in Indianapolis, and he was nuclear for uh, some time. No one could touch him. Now it's been, you know, four or so years, and now uh, the Vegas Raiders open up and he likes Derek Carr. He likes what they have there. He's not afraid of the competition there in the AFC West going up against Patrick Mahomes and Justin Herbert. And so, and maybe even Aaron Rodgers wants the Denver Broncos uh, try to get him. But what we have here is Josh McDaniels really uh, looking for a career renaissance. And uh, he had the job of his dreams <laughs> to be the offensive coordinator there with Bill Belichick. He was getting paid very well. The Crafts took very, very good care of him. He was never going to leave just to take any old job. And so when he met with the Raiders over the weekend, it was really a fait accompli at that point. The meeting went well, and now here we are today uh, as we had been reporting the announcement of Josh McDaniels as the new head coach. BMAC, do you like this move for Josh McDaniels? He's walking into the SEC version of the NFL. <laughs> I mean, you got Patrick Mahomes twice a year. You got Justin Herbert twice a year. The Broncos, maybe they get Aaron Rodgers. And now than that, their roster's pretty darn good. And you're getting Vegas here. Do you like this move? I like this move for the opportunity to once again become a head coach. But I don't like this move when it, when it comes to being competitive and being successful. Just in the division alone, like you just stated, EK, that's a very, very tall task. Just to come into this division and you know you have Justin Herbert, the quarterback power, star power they currently have. And Lord and behold, if they go get Aaron Rodgers, the Denver Broncos, that is, it's safe to say the Raiders would be dead last in the pecking order. So it's a very, very tall task just going into that division alone, not even knowing what will happen with the Denver Broncos and their quarterback position. But as the opportunity, you gotta, you gotta jump at it. And one thing he has, the luxury of knowing that he will have a quarterback that has experience and that has been successful in the National Football League in Derek Carr. Granted, this will be his last year on his current contract, but I think understanding and knowing Josh McDaniels and wants to be, he wants to be able to coach a guy at the quarterback position that has gotten the job done, I don't think Derek Carr will be going anywhere. And if you're a Patriot fan and you thought that you had your coach in waiting, you don't because Josh McDaniels is going to Las Vegas to take the job there. Well done, gentlemen. Certainly appreciate your time and your thoughts. So let's take a look at the coaches of the Silver and Black recently and what they've done. You know, you had Rich Bisaccia, and before that you had Raiden, John Gruden. You haven't really had a lot of success. That's right. No playoff win since you made the Super Bowl in 2002. So basically two decades without a playoff win. And uh, that is the task for Josh McDaniels. Get the silver and black back to Just Win Baby Days.